Hey, I'm Rob McCallum, writer, director of the Mr. Dress Up documentary, and I'm standing right now on the recreated Mr. Dress Up set. So I gotta take you for a tour to show you some of my favorite things. Let's go! My name is Rudin Kauzi, the production designer. Over the years, this iconic show changed many, many times. They had many reiterations. We sort of decided to build the set based on early 80s. I just, I just missed Wise Old Owl. He's a little sleepy, so I understand. But Wise Old Owl was one of those staple characters on Mr. Dress Up, who of course would disseminate sage-like advice. To wit to we, to wit to woo. So nice it was to see you too. Okay, here we go. This is the original treehouse. Whether it's couch cushions making a fort or a treehouse in our backyard, every kid needs their own little space for playtime for their imagination to run wild. And this was what Casey and Finnegan had, and we had it when we watched the show. The tricky part about this job was it's so highly charged emotionally. We already knew that we had thousands of people like going to be like, oh, that's not how it looked like. So we stayed as close as possible to it. And that's how we kept the set cohesive. So this, of course, is the iconic tickle trunk. I could open it for you, but no, we can't unleash that magic just yet. You'll have to watch the documentary for that. A holy grail artifact from the childhood of many people in Canada, including me. So that about does it for our set tour of our recreated Mr. Dress Up set. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at some of those iconic places that fill my heart and yours. Watch the documentary, hit the link, and get transported back in time to those grilled cheese and tomato soup days. For now, goodbye from Rob, and of course, all our loving memories of Mr. Dress Up. Bye-bye.